Hey YouTube, is Vistaprint really worth it? Let's find out. Ooh. Hey guys, today I thought we would talk about Vistaprint. I've used them for years. I am not affiliated with them. They are not sponsoring this video, but I wanted to share my what I just recently received and what I'm using it for. Now, most people use Vistaprint for business cards, which I always have for years. This was my first business card for my wildlife art, and it was okay. That was back when I was only doing graphite work. But since then, I've rebranded my website. I still use a wolf, but I use my colored pencil wolf. And I've changed my website colors and I wanted everything to be cohesive. So that's when I bought my new. And these have like a shiny metallic on them so they're kind of hard to see. But they're really pretty. And then on the back I have three pieces of artwork and a verse from the Bible that I like that speaks about animals. So I put that on the back. But along with my business card I decided I needed a few other things for branding purposes when I deliver something to someone. So if somebody buys something from me, I'm going to want to have some sort of card to give a personal note. So I originally bought thank you cards. And they're just real simple cards. They were on sale. I got a bunch of them. And I used my logo, my colored pencil, Wolf. The blue matches the blue of my website, and then on the back, it's my website name and my website address. And then inside, I just left it blank so I can write a little thank you in there. Also, when I package, and I'll have to do a, a packaging video later when I finish a uh, commission I'm working on right now, but when I package, I'm going to use tissue paper to wrap the print in. And then I'll seal it. Oops, wrong one. Hold horses. Technical difficulties. I got some stickers. I wanted to try them out, and they were the most inexpensive place to get stickers. And I have to tell you, I'm really happy with them. So I've got my branding of my sticker. So everything's cohesive. Everything works together with the branding. And... I'm really pleased with the quality. And last but not least, this finally came today so I could make the video. It occurred to me when someone buys a commission for someone as a gift, and I'll be sending the commission to the person receiving it rather than the person who's paying for it, it seems silly to send a thank you card. So I got some more cards here but this time instead of saying thank you they just say Kathleen Lengel Wildlife Art with my logo and then on the back I have my website address again but that way I'll have a nice little note card that I can write in and send a little personal note but it doesn't say thank you because they didn't buy it <laughs> So there's just some options for branding your business from stickers and thank yous to your business cards. And I have to tell you, I have been very impressed with Vistaprint for years. I've used them on other projects. I was a web designer for years. And for website design, my website design business, I used them for my all of my business cards for over 10 years. And not once have I been disappointed by Vistaprint. So if you're looking for an inexpensive way to get some business cards, definitely catch them when they're on sale. You can get outrageous prices when things are on sale at Vistaprint. But even when they're not on sale, the prices are so reasonable. So definitely look into getting your business cards. You can um, upgrade 
the type of paper you used. These come with free envelopes. You can get envelopes that are have a return address printed on them. I didn't want that, so I just got the plain white. But they're really good quality. So all in all, yes, I love Vistaprint, and I will use them many times more in the future. Well, that's about it. I hope it helps. Until next time, keep creating.